Good morning and welcome to my channel. About two weeks ago, I made a video about this plant, Hoya carnosa. At that time, it had nine flowers and there are not as many of them not right now, but it's still blooming, it's still beautiful. Uh, and I told you that I keep it on a south facing window, that this plant has plenty of light and that this plant is investing in flowers and not in the growth. Uh, this, the leaves are quite light in color because of the bright sun that is reaching them, so they don't need that much chlorophyll. Okay. And today, I would like you to see my other Hoya that is in a completely different spot. So this is the Hoya that is in a completely different spot than the other. And look how much different it is. We are in the bathroom. There is a window here in this bathroom. However, this window is facing a wall of another house. So there is not that much light coming through it. Okay. It's not that close to the window and it is, well, I wouldn't say huge, but it's a very large plant, okay? And at the tip of the stems, there are flowers. One flower here, one cluster of flowers here about to open very, very soon. And there is a cluster of flowers that will open here soon and on the floor here i didn't sweep the floor there are remains of a flower that uh faded and was somewhere here oh here it was probably here it was probably and uh just the flower the flowers the flowers that died and and fell on the floor so this if you look at the leaves of this hoya they are much darker in color. The stems are long and st the stems are growing constantly. The, the stems are long and growing constantly. I do not have that much uh, patience to water this plant regularly. I keep forgetting about it, I must say. And this pot doesn't allow me to water it abundantly because there is very much, uh, very little, uh, little room in the saucer. And from the top, if I try to water it from the top, it overflows. So this plant is not watered as much as it could. And yet, look, it is thriving. The reason I'm showing it to you is to show you how forgiving Hoya Carnosa is and how it doesn't care about the conditions in which it is kept. Okay? So keep that in mind when you have your Hoya don't stress much about it, just <laughs> neglect it a little bit. Don't water it too often and when you, oh, when you water it, water it quite abundantly and then wait for the blooms and they will appear. Okay? Thank you very much for watching my video about Hoya Carnosa. I hope you like it. I like it a lot. I really like this plant. It smells at night quite strongly. The smell is uh, sweet and a little bit suffocating, so I don't advise you, that I don't recommend to have this plant in the, in the bedroom. Bathroom is perfect for her or him or it, okay? Thank you very much for watching my video. Have a great day.